when we first saw the vault, it was scary as all get out. <laughs> it was this big, empty, ugly. Two bare rooms, no anything, no kitchen stuff, no appliance. There were some things that were just loosely laid in there, but no, no anything, anything. Ugly walls and painted cement floors. We came in here and there was nothing, you know, white walls, white walls. I, mean, I think most people would have looked at it, and most people did look at it, and that's why they're having a hard time selling it, I think, is because it was just ugly and no windows, and what do you do with it? My vision of this place is having used all the square footage, make a place so that there's all these little cubby holes, little places to nest. The vault has become, aside from the fact that it's a, a mini gallery and it's a, a venue for corporate events and for parties and fundraisers and all kinds of things we can rent it for, it's also a safe haven. It's like a, a little mini getaway, so we work all week and we can come down on the weekends and and it's, um, it's awesome. We absolutely love it. The vault is in downtown San Diego in the Gaslamp District, so right on 6th and Broadway, it's really close to everything on the strip of downtown. For as long as I've known him, we've talked about it forever, and we've described it to our friends, which is how it actually came about in the first place, is the, the guy was an inspector, and, and we go for coffee in the morning, and he says, hey, Scotty, I found your place. If I'm doing a, a function and have an art in here, I just don't want it to be one dimensional. You're kind of walking around and go, oh, that's really nice. I want to be able to go up some stairs and there's a whole nother row up there. So you get to use the wall height and you get to use all these little cubby, these little places. You know, people will come in here and like, how do you get over there? Oh, you got to go over there and up there and around there to get in there. And that's really what I wanted. I didn't want it to be so easy that you're just walking, oh, okay, I'll just go over there. This place allows you to be at the party, be away from the party, at the party, and not be off in some other room, not knowing what's going on. Every place in here, you pretty much can see what's going on through the place, through a porthole, what's going on in the main room. So you get to be with somebody and sit down and have a, a great conversation with somebody you want to talk with, but you not have to stand there and talk to 50 people you don't want to talk to. So we're really excited about the way the vault has turned out. Scotty has worked his magic again. The functions that we have had here have all been a major hit. People always come and leave with a smile, so it's been awesome. If anybody out there wants to rent the place, I'm Angie. Give me a holler. Every piece in here I've made. Everybody goes to build something. You're going to build a new home. You build a new house, build whatever you're going to build. And when you do that, you go and do the typical things. Oh, I'm going to get a designer, and we're going to look at this, this fabulous granite, and we're going to look at the stone, and, the doo -doo -doo -doo, and all this kind of stuff. That's not what I want. I want people to come in here and go, wow, I've never seen that before. You know. Now, some of this is all an experiment. Some of it, I don't know how well it's going to hold up. It may work out forever. It may just fall apart. I'm not really sure. Not structurally, I just mean finish-wise, you know, like structurally this thing's bomber. But, you know, there, there's things I experimented with and I wanted to try and I wanted people to see things like, oh, well, I've never seen that before. Where do you get that? Well, I made it. You know, so each thing is special and it doesn't mean you spend a lot of money. It means you, you spend a lot of imagination. I want to set myself apart. I want people to go, wow, that guy, you, that, he's different. And I've got things that I want to do that are in my head, swimming around in circles that's driving me nuts. That, but you got to start somewhere. You got to do you, you, here. Okay, we're beginning here, but you, wait till you see what's coming because there's some just great stuff I'm so excited about that's completely different. But I got to start here. So here I am. But you're gonna love them. They're really, really cool.